Hello everybody, Sean Wiggins, Wiggy Time on the Fly, what's up? I shouldn't be yelling that loud, I am in a cemetery right now. And yes, I do weird things at Wiggy Time on the Fly, and this is one of them. I like to be very round and versatile and show you all different things. So as on top of showing cool pregame rituals at sporting events and old wrestling matches that I refereed and old backyard matches that I was in or cool places I go, uh, one cool thing I like to do, um, that's why when my time comes, I do want to be buried, uh, is go visit grave sites and, uh, of heroes, of loved ones, of friends, whatever have you. And this one right here, we are at Grove Hill Memorial Cemetery here in Dallas, Texas. And very fitting that the Yellow Rose of Dallas the Yellow Rose of Texas, excuse me, David Von Erich, my personal hero, has brand new yellow roses here at his grave site. And uh, very, very interesting how um, they're fresh. So that means people do come and see him. This was David's baby right here. Um, passed away in 78. And uh, it's little known fact that Dave liked to take quaaludes, unfortunately it's the case. And, and Crown Royal was his choice, and a lot of people thought he was hiding, you know, masking pain. Uh, more so than that, he was probably mourning the loss of his baby, which I couldn't, um, I couldn't, couldn't put into words what that is. But if you walk over here, um, we're in the hilltop section here uh, uh, of the cemetery. Massive, massive cemetery, by the way. Shocking, I know. Here is... Uh, Jackie Jr. And some of these are fresh. So one of the um, uh, relatives must have come here. And that's Devon Eric's uncle, David Smith, which would make sense if David was named after him. But yeah, as you can see, little baby Yoda there. Jackie Jr. was the older brother of Carrie, Kevin, David, and Mike. Uh, Von Eric, he probably would have been an athlete as well. He only died when he was seven. Or six and a half. Uh, he was actually electrocuted, which is terrible. Uh, and there's a couple other others here. And I know it's morbid. Some people don't like going to cemeteries at all. Uh, I'm someone that does because uh, I think it's important to visit them. And here's the rest of the brothers. Here's Chris. Chris Von Erich. This off. I'm glad that someone came here and left flowers. Could have been a fan. Maybe a family member, and here you can see Mike Von Eric. It's really cool that people still come to visit them. And uh, you hear a lot of things that they were drug addicts and they were alcoholics and they partied too hard and this, that, and that. Man, it was the 80s, and anyone who looks at them and lowers their head and is shameful what they do. Uh, Shouldn't really do that. You know, it's a different time. It's a different era. The 80s were ridiculous. I mean, how many guys did we lose to that? But it's a whole other story altogether. Um, show not to show too many. La, 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 la. I'm lost again. I've been walking around for 20 minutes. If you hear me breathing heavy, that's why. Um, Oh, that's Jackson. It's not that. Here we go. And there, oh, here it is. There's Doris, the mother, the matriarch of the Von Eriks. She actually just died in 2015. Wow. So she was, if I could do the math quickly in my head, which I can't, she was 83. Wow. Wow. And here is. One of my heroes. Carrie Von Eric. There's Carrie. And he's buried with Fritz, the father, Jack Senior. Walking with my brothers, he uh, wrote a suicide note. And in it, he said, I walk with my brothers. And uh, he wrote that at his uh, ex wife's house the night before he killed himself. And wow, well, I'm glad to see that there's new flowers here. It's real, makes me feel good that people still come to visit things. And that's another reason why I do want to be buried. I think it's uh, 
cool way to remember people and um it gives you a chance that, oh, there's a cowboy's flag fitting we're in dallas the seahawks flag that's weird um and that's why when my time comes i would like to be buried and uh if people ever come to visit you it just shows the, the mark that you left but it gives everyone an opportunity to come see you whenever they want and a lot of people like to go i want to be cremated let my ashes spread here and i don't know the more i think about it the more uh the earth made me i want to be back in the ground and i don't know i'm going off on a tangent and my nose is running so i'm gonna wrap this one up so arrivederci and ciao and if you ever do want to come visit the von erics uh and and say a prayer or do whatever you want to do you can come to grove hill memorial cemetery the hilltop section it's called plot plot i'm saying that right 5 30 so uh that's it for now, and uh, I will be louder and jokier and funnier and uh, more open as in the videos that come along, and more videos to come later. So I hope you all en uh, enjoyed this one. I hope this was informative for people that do want to come visit the Von Erichs um, grave sites. It is in Grove Hill Memorial Park, Dallas, Texas, the hilltop section. So for Sean Biggins, I'm Sean Biggins saying arrivederci and ciao, and I hope you have an Excellent, excellent night. And as always, drive safe. Signing off.